48. Ooh, I just saw some wing flex. All right, so we are out here with the, I uh, don't know if we're calling this J&H Aerospace Ooh. Flight Test, whatever, the uh, Speed Demon. It is a Ooh. foam board kind of pylon racing type. Uh, I've got it on a 3-cell 800 right now. I'm hoping, you know, check my CG one more time. I hope that, that I can get this to launch successfully. So, here it goes. <laughs> Well, that's good so far. Actually needs a little bit of down trim. Pretty cool. And that's only on three cells. passes and put it up on something else. Orientation is a pain. Yeah, we'll go ahead and we'll try and land it. Lands like a pylon ship. Hot. Alright. I guess four cells next. Okay, so we're out here for round two of this. Uh, we've got a few minutes of air time on this plane uh, with the 5x5 uh, five five three blade. Stop, dropped it to a 5x5 five five, uh, two blade Gropner prop. So not as much climb, but uh, hopefully we'll get faster in a straight line. So here it goes. down trim here. Any speed reading on that, honey bun? No, I'm not. I'm filming right now. Or trying to. Alright guys, I'm gonna... Sorry, I'm gonna put the camera down. And we're going to do some speed readings, so um, we'll see how fast we can go this, get this thing. <clears throat> Alright, I'll give you one here in a minute. This is cruising about... Uh, 33. Hold on a second. 47. <laughs> yeah, I've got to work on some trim issues here. It is twitchy, and I think I got some tape that's flopping. Alright, here it goes. Um, 48. 48? So that was half throttle. Alright, try three quarters. Let's see if we can do it. Sorry. Right. It's 51. 51 on that? Wow, this thing is going to be properly fast if I can get it to straighten out on me. 48. Alright, so that was still like half throttle. I just saw some wing flex. Fifty-two. 
problem is... Sixty-two! Alright, let me... I'm gonna need a new See one. guys, sixty-two. Alright. Alright, let me do something real quick. This wing is not going to take a whole lot more of this abuse. Alright, ready? Sorry. 60! And that's the end of our testing for today. <laughs> Dang it! So what you guys didn't see was um, we reached 60 and basically the spar said I ain't doing anymore and it folded in half and it crashed so um, we will repair it <laughs> uh, two things dual rates used them uh, and the other is uh, carbon spars are a good idea so there's the wing and yeah I mean yeah. I hosed it pretty good I Needed to build another one anyway, but uh, was hoping to not destroy this one that quickly, especially after I made it look all pretty like and stuff. Yeah, but, and the tail uh, made it, so. Yeah, the tail, well, the whole thing's getting replaced. I mean, but. I tear the electronics out of it and start afresh, and it gives me a chance to test a new elevator servo setup, so there's that. But yeah, um, carbon spars are a must. Because, I mean, I, I was seeing some stress cracking a, across there. I thought I could get away with it. Uh, the answer was, no, I could not. At least my 4-cell battery has survived. Uh, speed controller looks to be all right. Um, so, you know, is what it is. Uh, we'll be able to use the same motor mount, I think. I think it's okay. Um, prop looks fine. So... You know, about 20-30 uh, minutes of building, and we'll have it revised. And I'm just going to edit the changes into the build video recording we already did for this airplane. So, yeah. Um, so we were getting about 60 miles an hour on four cells in really pitchy, oblique passes. So, I'm sure there were a couple where it was doing 100 miles an hour. It definitely... I uh, felt like it, but the, the problem is I've got a, um, I actually need to dial back the elevator throws because they're too what much. What you're trying to say is you have a horrible person that's running your radar gun. No, <laughs> no. It's hard to, it's hard to get good radar readings yeah. when, when somebody's pitching the airplane all over the place. True. So, so take that for what it's worth. Um, but, you know, um, I kind of expected this type of thing and... You, the other thing is this build was, this whole development was going way too smoothly, so there's something got to go wrong at some point. Eh, here's what it is. We'll build another one. Hi, I'm Josh Finn. This is Hope. We are J&H Aerospace. If you like this video, hit the like button. Also, how about subscribe to our channel and check out jhaerospace.com for new free flight products and all of the tooling that you'll need to build them. Thanks for watching.